What's up my beautiful angels? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Kelly and I have videos coming out every Tuesday and Thursday. So make sure that you guys are subscribed to my channel so you guys never miss out on any of my videos. Also, if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up as well. Also, really quick before jumping into today's video, I did just want to mention who is the winner of my first giveaway and I will have her name on the screen over here. If you are the winner, I will be messaging you to get all of your contact information and everything like that. I did also want to thank everybody for participating in this giveaway. And if you didn't win, don't be discouraged. I will have plenty, plenty more giveaways. So again, just make sure that you're subscribed so you guys find out whenever I'm doing another giveaway. Now, getting into what today's video is about. Today, I'm going to be reviewing February's Face Tori face masks. And if you guys missed out on last month's review video, Basically, I'm just reviewing Face Tori's sheet masks of the month, telling you what I liked about them, maybe what I didn't like about them. If you guys also didn't know what Face Tori is, it is a monthly subscription service and it is $5 a month plus tax. And you get four sheet masks a month and that's pretty much it. There is another option for I believe like $14.95 or something like that and you get I think seven masks. And it's much more like intense and in-depth masks than just like a normal sheet mask. So, but I like sheet masks, so that's why I chose this one. So yeah, February face story, let's go. All right, so the first mask that is on this little card that gives us the description of what the sheet mask is going to do and how much it is, is this sheet mask right here. And this is from Proud Mary Derma Cosmetics, and this is their Cereal Whitening Sheet Mask in the scent Apricot. And this just says that it's made from an eco-friendly tensile sheet. And this mask is made from both the apricot fruit and the apricot seed powder. And these two ingredients help to change dull and somber skin into bright and revitalized skin. It also revitalizes skin, it moisturizes the skin, and it removes dead skin cells. And this sheet mask retails for $2. And so this was my favorite mask out of all of the ones that I got this month. It was absolutely amazing. It smelled so good. It was a serum based sheet mask and what I mean by that is it's that like clear gel you know stuff and some other ones not in this month but in prior ones um, they were more of that like milky moisturizing feel so I do like the gel serum masks more than those so this was a serum mask and I just feel like my skin loved this stuff my skin was so glowy so moisturized and it felt so good I just absolutely loved this mask and I'm definitely going to be purchasing more of this specific mask the next sheet mask is this one right here and this is by SNP and this is their fruit gelato moisture mask in coconut and this again retails for two dollars this one also again was a serum based sheet mask and it says if you like coconuts you're in for a treat this SMP moisture mask not only contains coconut extract but also carries a refreshing coconut aroma that brings your mind and body to a place of serendipity the combination of fresh ingredients and undiluted fruit extracts help to hydrate both rough and coarse skin types so this is what the mask looks like well not the mask the packaging and it didn't really smell that much like coconut honestly it wasn't really that like overpowering and i didn't really notice it that much but it did smell very good i'm not the biggest fan of coconut but again it didn't really smell like anything so it really wasn't that big of a deal to me um this one was moisturizing but it wasn't as moisturizing as i would like it to be i've said that in you know previous a video for the face story stuff but I just felt like it could have done so much more for my skin. I didn't notice that my skin was like super glowy or anything, but it did feel soft to the touch. So, you know, it was like a pro-con kind of thing. The next sheet mask is this one right here, and this is from the brand Goodall, and this is their Baby Perennis Radiance Mask. Again, this retails for $2, and this one also was a serum-based sheet mask. It says, Perennis, a type of daisy often seen as the flower of children and innocence, is Latin for the word everlasting. So with this baby perennis mask, your skin can have an everlasting hydro radiance and glow. Made from mildly fermented argan oil and several flower complexes. So this sheet mask I loved as well. I felt like the smell was very like refreshing. It wasn't fruity. It was very like floral, but it wasn't super overpowering. So I really liked the smell of this. And I also really liked what it did. 
It didn't really moisturize my skin, but it did make my skin super, super radiant and like glowy. So I did really like that aspect of it because sometimes I find that my skin does look very dull. So this definitely did help with that. All right, and last but certainly not least, we have this one right here. And this is from Offwell, and this is their Honey Anti-Wrinkle Donji Mask. This again retails for $2, and it is a serum-based sheet mask. Are you guys getting tired of me saying that? Because I am. Anyway, it basically just says that this is dripping with honey extract to give elasticity and a densinine to care for wrinkles and royal jelly extract to add nutrients and moisture to your skin. So this one I really loved as well. This one is definitely up there with the first sheet mask that I showed you guys. And I just felt like this really, really moisturized my skin. I was very dewy, I was very moisturized, my skin was super super soft. I also really loved the smell of this one. It did smell like honey a little bit and so it was very sweet, very nice. And I just felt like when it was on my skin it just felt so good and so refreshing. So I did really really like this sheet mask as well. But yeah guys that is pretty much it for today's video. Again if you like this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. I have videos coming out every Tuesday and Thursday, so make sure that you guys come back to my channel on those days to see my new videos of the week, and I will see you next time. Mwah.